morning, Bonanza Broncos. I'm Ms. Hilliard, and today is Monday, May 15th. It is B-Day for middle school. We only have eight days left of school. This is our last full week, so we're so excited. We have so many things going on, so pay attention. On Monday, today, we have at 9.30, we have kindergarten promotion ceremony, and then at 1.30, we have first grade award assembly. So please, parents, come and see your children get your, their awards. Also this week, we have our book fair. It is open during the award assemblies and also during lunches. So kids, please come down and get some books. There are gonna be some amazing things to purchase. And then on Tuesday, we have our MTSS meeting. And then at 9.30, we have our second grade awards a ceremony. And then at 1.30, we have third grade awards a ceremony. And then fourth grade, they have their field trip. I believe they are going to the Lion Habitat, so that should be fun for them. And then on Wednesday, please say happy birthday to Ms. Bernanke. And then we have our book neck, we're redoing it. So families, please come during lunches from 11 to 1240 when your student has their lunch. We hope to see you there. And then at 930, we have our fourth grade award ceremony. Thursday, middle school, you start your final exams. You're gonna have periods one and two. It's a full day, it is A day. And then after um, lunches, you'll be with your, your homeroom, okay? And then teachers, you'll have your PLCs in the conference room to discuss your pinks and blues. Friday, it is gonna be C day for middle school. It's gonna be half day. You're gonna have your middle school exams, periods three and four. And then you'll get your grab and go lunch and you'll be able to go home. If you need to make up any exams, please talk with your teachers and you can do that after you pick up your lunch. Also on Friday, we have the eighth grade dance. It is at 5.30. So I'm so excited to celebrate our eighth graders for their last dance at Matter Bonanza. And then just some important dates on um, May 22nd is pre-K end of the year performance. May 23rd is fifth grade promotion. And May 24th is our last day, which is a half day of school. We wanna get some shout outs. Shout out to Mr. Harder for gaining their Vils End of the Year Award. We appreciate all your hard work, so congratulations. And then we have shout out to our volleyball and our soccer coaches for a great season. You guys did so amazing. And then shout out to teachers and staff for being flexible for next year positions. I hope we all have a great week and happy Monday. Hey everyone, um, on Tuesday, May 16th, we have our beginner piano concerts happening in the multi-purpose room. The first period will be happening at 3.45. Second period piano will be happening at five o'clock. So if you're in piano class, make sure you're there. If you want to check it out, come on by. Uh, on Wednesday, May 17th, we have advanced piano concert at 3.45. And then we have our band concert at 6 p.m. Our band concert will be featuring our beginning band, intermediate band, advanced band, as well as a few piano soloists playing throughout the concert. Um, so if you're in advanced piano or band, make sure you're there on that day. And if you're not, feel free to come check it out and see what we've, what we've been up to this entire year. Welcome back to Little Sports Corner, where we had some success getting our volleyball, varsity volleyball getting to their semifinal in their playoffs, but they lost a close one and only we have success building for next year's teams, meaning with the success this year, can only build to better programs coming up in the future. I want to give the hats off to Coach Rivera and Coach Laming for bringing a successful boys volleyball season. Congrats to Ms. Jackson and our cheer for placing third in their competitions. And in soccer also, we have three out of our five competitive teams making their playoffs. So coaches, good job this season. And last week, our boys' elementary team lost their playoff opener. So congratulations to Coach Lupak for that successful boys' elementary soccer season. And again, it's building up more competitive teams in our future. Varsity Boys Soccer and Coach Swan got to their playoffs as a seventh seed and had to win two of their games to make the finals. And by this episode, we will, we will know if they made their championship game. Both our MS... Our middle school soccer championships are dated for this Saturday, coming up the 20th, if they win both of their games this past Saturday for the first rounds of the playoffs. 
Our boys middle school JV and coach Farnsworth had their most successful in the regular season, being a first place going into their playoffs. So they got to win two, and who knows, meaning maybe both levels. Right now our JV is looking the most favorable, but we could do a big school rally, sending them to their final championship game on the 20th. So hopefully we'll stay tuned to see if they make their games and success leading in for the final game. Our spring 2023 season has come to an end and parents please help the school in sports finances by paying uniform and league fees. If you have not already, and if you have, we appreciate your support. This is Little Sports Corner and I am out. Welcome to Jokes with Jen. Today's guest star is Emiliano, and he has a joke for us today. Uh, what is sharks? What what do sharks watch on TV? What? Shark. Shark tunes. Shark tunes. <laughs> Thank you, Emiliano.